This is a message from the Texas government. On March 2, 1836, the Republic of Texas was created after breaking away from Mexico. Texas was an independent republic for only nine years until February 19, 1846 when Texas joined the United States. For years, we thought we were benefiting from being a U.S. state. However, we realized that we are more than a state. We are like a country. We would be more free to govern without the U.S. federal government. It would benefit Texas if it goes back to the old ways. As a result, the governor has declared Texas an independent state from the United States. Texas would be known as the Republic of Texas for the first time in more than 130 years. The U.S. Army is approaching Texas to make it stay in the Union. The Texas Military Department is aware of these U.S. soldiers and if any soldiers cross the border of Texas, it would be considered an invasion and the Texas military will respond accordingly. This message has been transmitted at the request of the U.S. government. In about 1.15 p.m., the state of Texas declared independence from the United States. U.S. Army soldiers have been sent to Texas to ensure that Texas does not leave the Union. Clashes between the U.S. military and the Texas military that resulted in casualties and deaths have been reported. If this continues, this might lead to a second civil war. Stay tuned for more information. This is a message from the Texas Republic. The Texas military has been attacked by U.S. forces. About 50 soldiers died, however the Texas military was able to defeat the U.S. military successfully. In retaliation, the Republic of Texas has ordered an MOAB missile, the largest non-nuclear missile, to strike Oklahoma City. The Republic of Texas hopes that it gives a message to the United States. Texas is now its own. It is no longer united with the Union. This message has been transmitted at the request of the U.S. government. Texas has declared independence as the Republic of Texas. The Republic of Texas has attacked the U.S. Army and killed 1,000 U.S. soldiers. The Republic of Texas has been designated as a terrorist group. The Republic of Texas has launched a non-nuclear missile at Oklahoma City. Citizens in Oklahoma City must evacuate or take shelter inside a sturdy structure such as a bunker. Stay away from windows and doors. All military reserves must report to the nearest military base as soon as possible. The Second Civil War has officially begun. Plans to invade Texas are underway. One of America's allies, Mexico joined the United States in reclaiming Texas back into the Union and stated that their military is on the way to Texas to defeat the terrorist group. Emergencia. 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 Este es un mensaje del gobierno de México. Nuestro aliado, los Estados Unidos, está teniendo una segunda guerra civil. El grupo terrorista, la República de Texas, tomó el control de Texas y declaró la independencia. El ejército mexicano con el ejército de los Estados Unidos liberará el estado estadounidense de Texas. No permitiremos que nuestro aliado más cercano pierda en manos de los terroristas. Las Fuerzas Armadas Mexicanas con las Fuerzas Armadas de los Estados Unidos ya liberaron el territorio estadounidense del control de los terroristas. Para más información, ingresa a www.
www.gov.mx This is a message from the Texas government. The United States has denounced our country as a terrorist state. Mexico and the United States decided to join together and try to take over this country. Both countries are holding back our forces. Our country is being invaded by these countries. We must set an example to the United States to show them what might happen to their country if they keep on trying to destroy ours. Ten nuclear missiles have been fired at Mexico. We hope to make an example of Mexico for trying to destroy us. The Republic of Texas will stand. Emergencia. 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 Este es un mensaje del gobierno de México. La República de Texas ha lanzado 11 misiles nucleares contra México. Ciudad de México, Tijuana, Ecatepec, León, Puebla, Ciudad Juárez, Guadalajara, Zapopan, Monterrey y Chihuahua. Los ciudadanos en estos lugares deben refugiarse de inmediato. Reúna un suministro de alimentos y agua para 14 días. Fallout es un producto de explosiones nucleares. Fallout es mortal. No abandones tu refugio durante 14 días. Refugiate ahora. Union of South American Nations Conference. April 15, 2025. To hear this conference in a different language, please change language settings. The terrorist group by the name of the Republic of Texas has separated from the United States and is currently in a civil war. Mexico, a United States ally, has joined with the U.S. military to eliminate the separatist group. The Republic of Texas has attacked Mexico with 10 nuclear bombs and invaded the country. As the Republic of Texas is now closer to the countries of South America, it poses a great threat to these countries. A plan is currently being set up to help defeat the Republic of Texas. If this plan succeeds, Texas will return to the United States, Mexico will be free of Texan control, and South American countries will be safe. This is a message from the Texas government. All countries in South America have decided to plot against the Republic of Texas. A plan from these countries to overthrow the Texas government has been unraveled. All countries in South America are a threat to Texas and must be invaded. In order to invade South America Texas must have a territory near South America to establish a military base to send troops and forces to attack South America quickly for a military advantage. Trinidad and Tobacco is only 6.8 miles away from South America. We will take over Trinidad and Tobacco, and then after setting up military forces there, we will invade South America. This is TTT. Please wait for a message from the government of Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. Warning. 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 Trinidad and Tobago are being invaded by the Republic of Texas. Evacuate all major cities now. Do not attempt to interact with enemy soldiers. The Trinidad and Tobago Defense Force is defending this nation from invading forces. This nation is now a part of the Republic of Texas. We will use this territory as a base for our troops. This base will be used to invade South America. We will invade South America before it invades us.
North Atlantic Treaty Organization Meeting. May 26, 2025. On March 6, 2025, the terrorist group called the Republic of Texas declared the U.S. state of Texas independent from the United States. This resulted in a civil war. Mexico, an American ally, tried to assist the U.S. in defeating the terrorist group by invading Texas. This backfired, though, because Texas attacked Mexico with nuclear missiles and then invaded the country. After South American countries heard about this invasion, they made a plan to destroy the terrorist group. Texas heard about this plan and invaded Trinidad and Tobago in order to establish a military base near South America for a military advantage against the South American countries in an invasion. If Texas is successful in invading South America, it will have enough power to resist most attempts to take down this terrorist group. If we want to defeat the Republic of Texas, save South America, and reunite Texas with the U.S., we must act now. Military intervention to defeat the terrorist group by all NATO countries has been approved. This is a message from the Texas Republic. U.S. and NATO forces have invaded all of Texas, except the capital city of Austin. Austin is the last stand. We will not go down without a fight. Our military is attempting to bring back our former territory. However, the U.S. is getting closer to the Texas capital. Stay calm. The government is trying to find a way to defeat the This is a message from the United States government. The Republic of Texas has been overthrown by the United States military. Texas soldiers must put down arms and surrender. There is nothing to fight. Do not attempt to resist U.S. or NATO forces or you would be met with deadly force. The leader and high-ranking generals of the Texas Republic terrorist group have been captured. They will be punished accordingly. Medium and low-ranking soldiers of the Texas military who were forced to fight for the terrorist group have been given amnesty and will face no charges. The civil war is officially over. This is an all-clear. Civilians are now safe to get out of their homes or shelter. Repeating, this is an all-clear. Ceasing transmissions at the tone.